All right, today is March 5th, 2013, and today we're doing another unboxing video, this time for the Matchbox cars that I've accumulated for at least the first week of March. Um, let's get right to it. First up, you've seen this in the haul video, this is the new London Taxi, the Austin FX London Taxi. Uh, 2012 collection this time he's got paint apps oh, tempos in front and at the back and nothing none of that corny stuff in, in this on the side of the, of the car let's check it out been to London a couple times actually I've actually ridden one of these things actually pretty cool um, a bit of nostalgia for me actually <coughs> Uh, we're using a chessboard. <laughs> you, guys, you guys can see how it rolls. Uh, play some chess. Uh, a, bunch, a lot of chess uh, at some point in my life. Pretty cool. Love this car. <coughs> Excuse me. Next up is the Red H3. Uh, this was previously released, I think, in 2011 as a green, army green uh, Hummer. Now it's for the Matchbox Mountain. Uh, series 2012 Hummer H3 done in red. Let's see that? Wow, it's pretty heavy. Really nice. Let me show you guys. Sorry, I didn't show the front. Yep. This one's pretty cool. Uh, the grill and the lights aren't painted. Kind of sucks. They painted the fender, uh, and they have H3 right there. Hummer. Not bad, it's a glossy red finish. Oh, rolls very smoothly. Alright, next up, the uh, oddly colored Porsche 911 Turbo done in nail polish purple. Not bad, I love the casting on this one, but the purple, a little bit off for me. But, you know, what can you do? It's bordering on black. But it's actually a, um, I mean, if you have a Cyclonus figure, it, it's something like that, but a little bit darker. So, sorry for not the fans. Um, all right. Now we'll put it in there so I don't, I'll keep rolling. <clears throat> Next up, uh, let's do this one. I showed this in my haul video, the Garbage Grinder. I picked up two of them so I could open up one. It's a little bit light than what I expected. Uh, I was expecting this part to be at least die cast, but it is actually. So die cast here and here, but a, a whole lot of plastic on the back. Nevertheless, it is an interesting mold. I like new molds. It rolls fine. Very nice. Love it. I like the green on it. It's so eco-friendly. And love these tires. Look at that. Uh, this thing doesn't move. So, yeah. The garbage grinder. Next, we have a repaint. This is uh, from 2013 collection. As you can see, there's uh, it's number 52 of 120. Check it out. Matchbox, ve Matchbox vehicles for 2013. This one actually had a broken. So I was thinking of keeping this one in packaging, but the broken bubble really made a decision for me. And I didn't want to buy another one because I just needed one. So pretty cool. Not a big fan of the gold paint. But hey, it runs pretty smoothly. Um, I like this casting of the CTS uh, Cadillac <clears throat> uh, station wagon. Not too bad. Paint apps are actually pretty cool. Let me show you guys that. All right. And the last one I'm going to show you, which I've been meaning to open up, is the um, 2013, as you can see, 60th anniversary, Matchbox Adventure City, the 1964 Austin Mini Cooper, and it's very nice. Look at that. Look at this. Uh, there's some, the tempo say, uh, the tempo say 1964, it says Mini. I love the paint scheme on this one. Really just loving it. Uh, let's see. It's 
heavy despite being petite uh, of a vehicle. Does it run smoothly? Yes, it does. Very smooth and fantastic. Just phenomenal paint apps on this one. Absolutely brilliant. So let's put everybody on back there. This has been the opening an opening unboxing video. Some of the matchbox cars I picked up for the first week of March. There you go. Thanks for watching.